A Perth company has developed a robot that's being described as a game changer for the building industry. The world first machine lays bricks with laser precision and can build a home's walls in just two days. But tradies are worried the high-tech brickie could cost WA jobs. No shovels, no cement, no heavy lifting. This is the brickie of the future. It's called the Hadrian, a fully automated robot which can lay more than a thousand standard bricks an hour and complete the bones of a suburban house in just two days. It could cut the cost of a new home by 10%. It's a real game changer, not just for the brick laying but for the whole build. It's the ultimate 3D technology in action. Architects and engineers develop a 3D model of a home and the machine prints it on the ground. Internal and external walls, plumbing and electrical channels. It cuts the bricks to size, places them on a conveyor and with a boom 28 metres long, lays them in exactly the right spot. The machine's accuracy maintained by a precision laser. It understands the exact placement and size and requirement of every brick in the structure. There's no need for mortar. The robot uses a construction adhesive approved for use here, but more popular in Europe. It's better for the environment and keeps the temperature inside more consistent. So far, $8 million has been spent on the fast brick robot, and while it's still in its early stages, it's already making waves in the building industry. It has the potential to displace a lot of people if it were to be embraced. But the big question is, to what extent this technology will be embraced by the building industry? What do you think? That's shocking. There's no way that can be accurate. Perth inventor Mark Pivak was inspired to create the fast brick robot during the bricky shortage back in 2005. But now WA tradies are worried about the impact. I think it's ridiculous. I mean, there's jobs not out there at the moment as it is, and they're bringing robots in, and you know, it's just going to take everyone's jobs. I never thought that day would come, though, that a robot would take a bricklaying job. While job losses are possible, exposed brickwork and specialist jobs can't be done by a robot, and the Hadrian's creators say they'll employ bricklayers to operate the machines. So this bricky robot isn't going to replace everyone overnight, that's for sure. The commercial version of the fast brick robot will be small enough to mount on the back of a truck, but the boom will be two metres longer. Engineers hope to have the first one on the road by the end of 2017. The new Hadrian X model will be built here in Perth. It's likely to be launched in Europe and the UK first, but its creators are confident it's just a matter of time before the robot takes off here. No one's been able to achieve the things that we have. Estelle Lewis, 9 News.